It's once again a beautiful day, right guys? Are you back? Yeah. Yeah, I guess so. Do you guys want to go out for a stroll? Yeah. 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 All right, let's go. Uh, Hydro, where are we going? Going out for a stroll, like we always do. Aw, oh, man, I want to go to a restaurant. Me too. Ugh, guys, it's too early to go to the restaurant. Oh man! Let's just finish our walk, and then we'll go from there. Okay! I'm good with that. Me too. Hey, Hydra! Oh, hello, Wingo. How's your day going? It's been amazing. I've been doing some very funny pranks. <sighs> Wingo, what did I tell you last time when you did a prank? Uh... Let me think... Uh, no, I've forgotten all about it. What, you forgot what I said? Yes, I'm afraid so. Sorry. Don't worry. We forget too. Guys, hush for a minute. What did you do this time? Well, me and Ursa went out for a walk. Then we saw Mr. Phoenix up ahead. Ursa found a water bottle. I spat in it, gave it to Mr. Phoenix, and he drank it! <laughs> you did what? I know. It was a clever one, am I right? Windigo, that was my water bottle. The 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 what what what? You're telling me that you and Ursa took my water bottle, spat in it, and gave it to Mr. Phoenix? Well, from the Y to the E to the S, I did. No wonder why I can't find my water bottle that day. Windigo, you shouldn't do that. Well, we apologized right after. It doesn't matter. You have no idea how embarrassed I am for you right now. Come on, Hydra, get over it. It's not that big of a deal. <laughs> okay, okay, fine. I, I just don't want you getting into any trouble or getting me involved, okay? Stay out of trouble and I'll see you then. Wait, Hydra. Wait, Hydra! Are we gonna finish our walk? No, I I'm too worried. I just don't want him getting into any trouble. Ugh. Hey, watch where you're going, Knickknack. Sorry, it's just... Uh, I need to get home. Uh, why? Uh, n never mind. Weirdo. Oh, what am I gonna do? I did not even know that was his water bottle. What's going on between you two? Oh, nothing, Mr. Phoenix. Wait a minute. Did you say water bottle? Yes. I can explain, Mr. Phoenix. Explain about what? When you and Ursa pranked me with his water bottle? Ah, uh, yes. Wait, how, how did you know that? Don't even ask. I know everything. Plus, I heard you guys from down there. Oh, well, that's why. I don't know what to say to him anymore. Well, it looks like you two need to talk it out. Maybe that will calm things down a bit. Uh, I don't know, Mr. Phoenix. I don't know if he'll listen to me. Then make him listen. I would bring Ursa along with you as well. Maybe he would like to talk to him too. Hmm, maybe. Actually, that might be a great idea. Thank you, Mr. Phoenix. Anytime, bucko. Or weirdo. Uh, Ursa, are you in here? <laughs> Ursa. Ursa? Ursa? Ursa! Uh, Winnie-go, what's the matter? You weren't listening to me, Ursa, so I had, I had to pull your headphones off. Well, don't do that. You scared the heck out of me. I I'm sorry. It's just Hydra needs our help. Hydra? Yes. Oh, uh, Hydra needs help? Yes, it's what I said. Oh, does Hydra need... A doctor? Wink. No, Ursa, not that kind of help. We need to talk to him. Oh, I thought he was sick. No, Ursa, come on and I'll show you. Okay. Okay, the reason why is because Hydra is very upset. Why is he upset? It's such a beautiful day outside. No, he's upset because I told him about the water bottle prank situation that we did. Oh. It turns out that water bottle you found was his water bottle. Oh, how was I supposed to know that, man? I don't know. L let's just go talk to him. Okay.
Oh, when to go, should I knock? No, Ursa, I should knock. He's mad at me the most. Oh, okay. Hydra? He's not answering. Try it again. Come on, Hydra. We're really sorry. Huh. I guess he really is not forgiving us. Yeah, let's just go. Well, I'm breaking in! Ursa, don't! Yeah! Oh, no. Oh. <gasps> What's all this noise out here? Hydra! Ugh. Hydra, we really need to talk to you. If it's about the situation, I'm not talking. Oh, no, it's not about the situation. We're only here to give you a checkup. <laughs> Ursa, that's not what I said! Then what did you say? That we're going to apologize to him for stealing his water bottle. Oh. Wait, what? Look, we're sorry for stealing your water bottle. Yeah, we had no idea that it was yours. Uh, okay. And I'm also sorry for breaking the rules of what you said before. What? You didn't break any rules. I just didn't want you to get into any trouble. Wait, you were getting into trouble when ago? Well, uh... Maybe, but not too much. Uh, look, Wingo, I'm really sorry for overreacting. Your pranks are funny and all, it's just, I don't want you to get into any trouble. Oh, so he's helping you. How sweet. Shush, Ursa. So, does that mean we're still friends? Of course we're still friends, and I accept your apology. All right. Yes. Just don't get into any trouble out there! Yeah, like Dennis the Menace. Or Bart Simpson. Oh, you guys. So, how was it? He accepted it. Wait, what's about Mr. Phoenix again? Uh, Ursa, one quick question. Yeah? Why are you wearing a doctor's outfit? Oh, uh, it's my Halloween costume. <laughs> oh, okay, that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> Uh, Halloween is right around the corner. Ursa, that wasn't the main reason why you wore the doctor's outfit. But it does make you prove a point. Uh-huh, it sure does.